We're all looking at ways of living the good life. Well, Margaret River couple Jamie and Lara McCall reckon they've discovered the secret. On this eco-friendly farm, they are doing and growing everything themselves. Idyllic is a word that easily comes to mind on this delightful farm. Hello, Duk Duks. Look, you're beautiful. Sustainable is another word, and the McCalls practice what they preach from the ground up. It's good compost makes good vegetables. That looks like more than good compost. It's great compost. <laughs> As you can probably guess, I love a good veggie garden, compost and all. And I'm so envious of Lara's creations. Lara, this is enough to make a grown woman cry. I have never, ever seen anything as big as that. Are we going to chop and go? Yeah, sure. <laughs> this is just, oh God, it's just incredible. That would be about 10 of my plants. Oh, look at that. That's tonight's dinner? Yeah. <laughs> Living the good life on this eco-friendly farm is a lot of work for Jamie and Lara and their three boys. So they enlist all the help they can get. What a welcome committee! Hello, cookies! Woo! <laughs> they're beautiful. Yeah, they are. So they're our lawn mowers yeah. and our weeders and our fertilizers. If you have a look at, at its mouth. Oh. You can see that it's it's actually got serra serrated edges, which are almost like your teeth, <laughs> and that's what it grinds the grass off with. Oh, really? So that's its little mowing machine. The payoff when you care for your environment so much is a rich harvest of delicious homegrown and homemade produce. We've got salami and prosciutto that we make from our own pigs. Macadamias, uh, eggs. This is your own wine. Three boys. That's, that's right. Gorgeous. And just some homemade bread. This must make you so proud. Yeah, um, I mean, it's fantastic. Um, we do eat very well and that's part of our life. And what a feast. We love eating good food, growing our own food. I think everyone should do that. So no bosses? No, no bosses, but no um, Mercedes in the driveway either. It's not a way to make a lot of money. It's all about having a lifestyle. You can follow that dream and, and do whatever you want, but you need to actually stop and, and look at what you're doing in your life. And I think a lot of people today are too busy and too stressed to ever set aside that time to do that. A lot of people worry about making money for some imaginary life they might have in the future, that they don't worry about the life they're having now. And it looks pretty idyllic. Yeah, it is. We do, yeah. we like yeah. our life.